Hey everyone, this is Just a Tech and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I will show you how you can install the files of file manager without jailbreak on the latest iOS 16 as well as on the latest iOS 15. You can install it on any iPhone or iPad model. Yes, you heard it right. This you can easily install it without jailbreak and all the latest iPhones or iPad models are supported. You can install it in a single click. I will show you the complete step and tutorial in this video. So let me just go to my computer screen and start this process. Alright, first you need to set up some files. First you need to download the latest iTunes from the Apple official website only. Don't use the iTunes from the Microsoft store that will not work for you. So after the download simply install it. Next you need the Filza file manager IPA file for the latest iOS 16 as well as for the latest iOS 15. The same file work for the 16 and 15 so download the latest one. Now on the iOS 16 the supported iOS version is the iOS 16.1.2 down to the 16 and all other iOS 15 version. Now next you need to sideload that Filza IPA file. To use that you can use the sideloadly as well as the all store is another option for the mac os and the windows as well both the tools require the latest itunes version from the apple website also you can download the icloud software from the apple website only for this video i'm using the all store method but you can use the site loadly also on the site loadly i made the so many videos on my channel so you can refer that the process is same so you can see that i've downloaded the ipa file also the all store application and for the itunes and the icloud i have already downloaded from the apple website and install it already so i will skip that part you can simply install it it's very easy so next you need to extract the all store zip file also one suggestion Whenever you download installing this IPS file and site load it, make sure you off the Windows Defender also the antivirus so that the connection will be good as sometimes these antivirus and defender may block this IPA file and site load this. So make sure you turn it off and after that you can simply install. Now after that run the alt server, search it on alt server and you will get in the result. You don't find any icon of the alt server on the desktop so you need to search it and then run it. After that you will see this icon. Alright now next make sure your iPhone and your system will be connected with the same Wi-Fi. After that open the iTunes and tick this option. Click on apply and then. Now you are set up with the all store server. Now next you have already downloaded that iCloud software. Open that, sign on to your Apple ID account and make sure you are connected with the same Wi-Fi and the same Apple ID in the device as well as in the all store server. After that sign in in the account and click on OK. Now after that all store will give you the notification that it is installing the application onto your device. So wait patiently it will take around 1 to 2 minutes and after that you will see the all store application on your home screen. Now you can see you will get this all show icon. Click on that. Now first you need to trust this app from the device management. Now you can see the all store is here. Now you can easily sign any IPA file for the 7 days. After that repeat the process for the continuous days. Now first you need to sign in to your same Apple ID account that is linked in your device. And after that you can easily sideload any IPA file for free. Now next you need to transfer that IPA file to your device. You can use the airdrop or you can transfer from your system to the device or you can download directly again from the official website and make sure that this IPA file for iOS 16 works for the iOS 15 device also and the iOS 16 supported the 16.1.2 down to the iOS 16 and for all iOS 15 devices. So you can use that on any iPhone or iPad model if you have the supported device. Now after that share that app in the all store and you will see it start installing. But make sure that first sign into your Apple ID account so that it will sign the app for the 7 days. Now it's showing you the instruction how it's work and how you can resign the IPA file after the 7 days. Connect with the same Wi-Fi or the PC and after that simply install it and sync the app.
Now the Filza file manager is here and it's installed in your device. Go to your home screen and you will see the icon on that. Alright now the important step if you are on iOS 15 on any device you can run it directly. But if you are on iOS 16 to the 16.1.1 you need to turn on the developer option from the previous setting. Go there, scroll it down and you will see the Apple developer option on or off on the iOS 16 devices. And after that, you can open the Filza and use it. And if you still can't find it, I will show the instruction on the screen so you can follow it and turn it on. And after that, you are ready. Now open the Filza file manager and wait for it. Now here it is and you can see that we are getting the full root access on the latest Filza file manager on the latest iOS 16 as well as on the latest iOS 15 and there is a lot of cool stuff you can do with the Filza file manager and you can edit the binary files and after that you can do some changes in the Apple internal files and you can do the full customization on your iPhone. So there are a lot of things you can do it if you know how to use it. It's a good and best thing for you. So I will make the separate video if you want to know how you can configure and edit the files and do the customization on your iPhone. Write down in the comments and I will make. So just for you, I will just make a demo folder and show you, you will get the full root access. So now you can see the folder is done. So you will get the read write access and the full access of the root. So you can try that and easily install the Filza file manager but this way without jailbreak. And if you reboot the device it will work normally. So you can double tap if sometime it's crash. You can just reopen it again and after that it will work. And after the 7 days you can resign the app again with the same old store and after that it will work. Or you can install the IPA file from the site loadly that will also work. So let me just reboot the device and show you after the reboot also it's working good. So that's how you can install the files of file manager without jailbreak on the latest iOS 16 to the 16.1.1 also the ios 15 devices so that's all for today's video i will see you in the next one so till then goodbye take care and peace out